I guess while I'm here, I should check out this thing. My house, my, my beautiful house. Flawless house. Oh, I should also turn my graphics back up to fancy. Now that I'm out in the area anymore. I don't know, this is all the random junk I have lying around. I'll probably move all the stuff from intersection 2 here. Uh, once I'm done there. Which I just have one more area. So that could turn into quite the journey again. Okay, I am ready to go into the next area. Shipwrecked Assault. So I think with this one, there was supposed to be some kind of lore or something. Should I get a boat? Nah. Yeah, I think there was supposed to be some kind of lore with this. And uh, it's like these jungle boats were like... Like the bull was supposed to be their idolized magic item. And they like lived in one of these places. Maybe they lived in the temples or I don't know and so then these other like invaders I guess came they're trying to steal the the wool and so then that's why they, it was in that ship and then that's why half the ship is missing and the other half is actually is sunk down on the bottom I guess ladders and TNT oh I should have made more ladders okay I'm gonna do that actually and then there's a bunch of boats yeah, okay, I'm actually going to go get, get a bunch of ladders. Uh, I think that'll, that'll be useful because then instead of having to use blocks to get on the thing, then I can just use ladders. All right, 55 ladders should be plenty. And I don't know what I want to take off my bar. I want blocks, the redstone torches, the ladders, I guess the food. Um, I'd Actually, I don't even know if I'll need the... if I'll really need the TNT, though, because it's not like these are that dangerous. Oh, I can take that piece of TNT as well. Alternatively, you could just, you know, swim under all these things and it wouldn't matter. Uh, I guess there's nothing on this boat. I think there's like two different types of skeletons, but they're all, like, they're all the same, but they have, they just have different attributes. Okay, then. Oh, and they spawn zombie pigmen, so they, they don't actually... Okay, no, I need to have food on my bar at all times. Um, so this means they can spawn in daytime, essentially. And I guess this is the painting room. <laughs> ah, classic random loot. It's just completely useless. Okay, no, wait, wait, the arrows. I'll take the arrows. So there's a bunch of guys over there. Kill that guy. Oh, more spawned. And they're fighting each other. You know what? Aha! Into the ground I go. And now they're dead. Eh, I guess it's not it's not a bad strategy, it's just kinda you know pointless to do it that way. It's not entirely though. I guess I'm actually not really using the blocks, so I can One, blow up creeper. I did it. This is probably the easiest area in this intersection. Though actually, now that I think about it, I do remember the boat being pretty hard. Like the big boat, these are just the tiny ones. Down I go! It's pretty simple, they're just going boat to boat. Oh, I didn't, I didn't even grab a boat. Completely forgot about doing that. I guess I don't really need one. Since I can just, you know, use... What am I saying? I can just use, uh... I completely lost track of words. I don't really need a boat because I can just use the depth strider I got. 
Oh yeah, there's like the other half of the boat that's like sank down. And then there's like the main part of the boat. We have here, where are you guys? God, get, die. Oh, there's a bunch of anvils in here, okay. That's nice. That's also great. More, uh, very, very useful loot. I'll, have to, I'll probably come back and loot all these things. Gotta get up here. I don't even need the TNT. You really don't need the TNT most of the time. It's just more fun to use the TNT, I guess. Oh no, I don't want to use it here though. Otherwise I might lose all that really good loot. <laughs> Actually no, I wouldn't even lose it. The chest would just get destroyed. Got this uh, really good... Really good armor. <laughs> what was named? What is it? Bull Native's Bow. Just, just a bow. Bull Native's Hat. Oh, they're like the Bull Native's <laughs> Nets. I guess that makes sense. So like they're the, it's their native land and they uh, be, it's being stolen from by the uh, invaders. Uh. Also, I think these ships are just different colors of each other. Like they're the exact same thing. I will destroy you all. Let me in here. You don't even really need to do anything in these, like, places. Like, you, you could just ignore all these boats. And just... I guess you wouldn't necessarily see that by swimming underwater. Without water breathing or respiration, but like... Whatever. I guess I'm just gonna go to all these boats and take them all out. Well, I guess this one's destroyed a little bit. So it's like they fought each other. Just destroying more things. Oh, there's one of the uh, other guys. I guess they wear evil black armor. Because darkness equals bad. That's, that's how colors work, right? Alright, shoot me. Now I do that, and then I d and then get out of here. Goodbye. There are so many of these boats, though. Jeez, I did not realize how how many there were. Like, look at all this crap. I didn't even get. I didn't even see this one. And now he's in the water. Oh, okay. Depth Strider boots. That's useful, I guess, if you want here first. Except, no, not that you're gonna f go <laughs> get the item first. Get, 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 what the? Like, hit him, and then he didn't die for another, like, full second. I don't know. I think it's just, that's just the multiplayer update. Like, way back in 1.3. I still don't like that they did that. I mean, I get why, and it makes a lot of sense. It's just so frustrating. Because then it's like you basically just can't have... You can't just play the game as a single-player game. It has to be over an internal server. And it just introduces so much unnecessary lag. It's like, really? Come on. Okay, oh, another shield. I guess I'll place my shield. I guess shields are really common in these loot chests. <laughs> a cordis root. Yeah, that's a, that's some useful loot right there. <laughs> cordis root. That has to just be a joke, right? Like, there's no way that was actually intended to be a useful loot thing. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, you didn't die. Die already. Okay. 
think I'm almost done with all these orange boats. And then I'll move on to the uh, other ones. I'll still have to grab more TNT because I'm like almost out. Hey buddy, go away. I feel like I could say more about this area, but I don't know. It's pretty simple gameplay. Just kind of running around all the different ships. Just, it's the same thing if you use the TNT strategy. Just wasted a piece though. <laughs> Take out the ships and move on to the next. Uh, I think there's still like that one and that one. And then I gotta go on to the other ones. That was descriptive. Not really challenging. I mean, I basically have just the equivalent of chain armor on right now. Oh my gosh, this guy. <laughs> it's so annoying. Uh, oh, there's also that. I wonder what's over there. I think that might be where a shortcut come a shortcut comes out. Not really sure though. We could go over there. This guy's gonna follow me though, unfortunately. Actually I have Depth Strider, so he's not gonna be able to outrun me. And I think behind that sail over there is a uh like right above my crosshair, there's one of the banners. But <laughs> now that I look at that, that is the most inefficient, just useless sail. Like, really. Like, that sail would not help you at all. Get, die. Is this not power 2? Like, look, th there would not get, like, any wind in. <laughs> like, not one that single sail could not possibly support the entire boat. I guess, I guess unless maybe the sunken part had a ton of sails. I also just, you know, don't know anything about sales, so. There's that too. That was not... Why did I... <laughs> I don't know. Just climbing up a waterfall. Oh, now that I think about it, I think there's iron up here. Use my completely balanced shield and take zero damage from creeper explosions. It didn't even take up that much durability. These things are just so broken. I think that's one of the reasons why I didn't want to put shields in the map. Because, like, shields are just so insanely overpowered. And, you know, I'm just going to use ladders to get up here. Because, screw it. But yeah, like, if you have shields from the start, you're pretty much invincible to any kind of threat that you can that can be thrown at you. Oh my... <sighs> Skeletons are so infuriating. Like, it's really- it's the, I think it's mainly the fact that they can just knock you around at range. It's like ranged enemies in Skyrim, for example, aren't that threatening. Or like any more than- they're not more threatening than any other enemy. It's just they have range, but skeletons can knock you around because Minecraft is so weird with the way it does combat. Why is he jumping around like a crazy person? So just oh, blow up! There you go. Why are there? Oh, right. There's like no spawning spaces around here. Oh, there's a chest here. Okay. Anything up here? Could be. It's probably nothing. Gotta slowly... Oh, wait, I can just use ladders. Learned this from... This is from... What am I saying? I learned how you can do this from a speedrun for... What's it called? Uh, Spellbound Caves. Someone did that. Oh, it's a random loot chest with nothing in it. Now, that's really 
That's 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 really good. Yeah. Mm-hmm. A name tag. Yeah, for all those all those pets I have that I like naming. <laughs> what do we have here? A speed potion and strength potion. Okay then. Guess I'll take this iron while I'm up here. I think if I dig like this way, then I'll run into one of the intersection three areas, but I'm not gonna do that. Wee Now I swim back to boats. Uh, I do, yeah, I do remember this boat being like threatening. And I think that up there, that waterfall goes to uh, intersection three. I think there's some like long and convoluted like thing you gotta go through to get there though. And I think these things are literally just the same skeletons as before, just with different uh, colored armor and different names. So nothing really interesting here. <laughs> Guess these guys were shipping crafting tables and a uh, bunch of garbage loot. I will take that sword though. I'm running low on swords. <laughs> oh, attacker! Oh, getting in, getting into that deep lore. You can tell how much thought I put into this. It's, just, it's amazing how much thought I did. <laughs> Uh, this just makes me want to like try something like this again, though, you know. Like, like try making a, another map. But nope, not gonna, not gonna do that. For a while, anyway. Oh, they just, they're just gonna kill themselves for me. Did you jerk? <laughs> God damn it! Go away. Okay. And all of you must die. Stop shooting me. Oh yeah, I've been picking up lots of arrows from these guys. I forgot that they dropped so many arrows. So I can just... Yeah, since, especially now that I have a power two bow and I can almost always two-shot the guys, so I can easily just... Make a profit with arrows. And especially since I'm not even using arrows to kill them a lot of the time. I will destroy you all. I'm actually losing a lot of health. I don't get why this guy's trying to like get right at me though. Normally they don't do that. I guess I don't need this TNT here. Oh, right as I come up there, they spawn. Also running very low on ladders. Hopefully I can find some wood in a chest. So I don't have to harvest more wood. Go away, go away. Come on. Did you just die? <laughs> Almost got through all these things. There we go. It's actually becoming daytime again. So I got all those boats. I don't think I got this one. It's already like a entrance for it though. Uh, I don't know if I want to go up there yet. I think I'll probably finish this area, then I'll do a loot run through, and I'll head like up there. Are those horses? <laughs> There's horses here. Okay, so the horse armor makes a little more sense. I mean, it's still pretty much completely useless, but you know. At least there actually are horses. <laughs> I guess these guys were transporting horses. But like, they'd be so useless in this area though because they're so like, you know what, I'm just leaving them in here. <laughs> I'm 
yeah, horses would be so useless here because, uh, it's all it's all water. Like you're not gonna get anywhere with that. Okay, there's some wood. Oh wait, what am I? I have wood on me. I'm a genius. <laughs> get stick. Make ladder. Okay, that should be plenty of ladders for the rest of the area. And I just picked up a bunch of garbage again. Nice. Almost got every boat though. Nope. Put stop. Stop. <laughs> uh, I just start getting like flustered and then I just like lose all my words. And then I like can't think of anything to say. Especially like like if there's not really anything to say about this area. It's just a bunch of boats. So it's like I very quickly run out of things to say. <laughs> How many chickens are oh my gosh. <laughs> How many chickens? <laughs> you know, I could start a chicken farm, but I'm fine with just using potatoes. So screw it, I'm gonna release these things. So many eggs. Why am I picking these eggs up though? I mean, there's no. I'm not gonna use them for anything. I want to even give you leads so you can get the chickens out of here. <laughs> Why did I put three million chickens in here? <laughs> 